the front door? What's going on here? Who are you lot? Oh, don't mind us. We'll only be a minute. Honestly, go back to bed. No, you all need to leave or I'm going to call the police. Oh, come on, be reasonable. It took us quite a while to set all this up. I don't care. You can pack it all up and take it with you. We'll be 15 minutes, tops. 20 as a push. I'm sorry, but you can't just come into my house and do... What are you doing? We're sending a message to our leader. The Almighty One. The Prince of Darkness himself. Can't you just email him? We usually serve up an offering. Mostly virgins. I'm not a virgin. You're very welcome to join us if you like. I'm sure we could squeeze you on the table. Why are you doing this to me? Where are my manners? I forgot to introduce myself. I'm Jacob. What's your name? That's Stephen. Well, I must say, you have a lovely home, Stephen. Can you just leave, please? Mm, well, you did leave the front door open. It was unlocked. So what? Well, anybody could have walked in. You know what it's like around here. It's a good job we turned up when we did. We're very community spirited. Jill here works with children. She's always wanted them. But she's barren. That's no excuse. You can't just come into my house and use it for a bloody ritual. What's he doing? Oi, put them back. Go on, put them back. That's my dinner for work tomorrow. Can you tell him to stop pissing about with my chicken drumsticks? Guys, I, I'm, I'm really not feeling this anymore. Oh, oh, it's just the vibe, it's totally off. Just have a little patience. Stephen here will be going to bed very soon. No, actually, Stephen will not be going to bed until you all leave. I just didn't think it'd take this long. You made it sound way better on Gumtree. It's just a minor delay. Nothing to worry about. Lay back down. Can we get a cushion? My back's getting really sore on this table and there's an eggy whiff coming from around here. I, c I can taste it. That's it. Think of kittens. <laughs> Listen, all this nonsense is going to wake my wife up. Why don't you ask her to join us? No, because you're not staying. Besides, she wouldn't like all of this. It's morbid. She might not like you making her decisions for her. Shall we invite her down? No! No. She'll kill me if she sees all of this. I see. And do you feel like this quite often, Stephen? Under the thumb? I'm not under the thumb. I'm not. She's just very particular. I imagine quite a lot of people take advantage of you, don't they, Stephen? But you know what would really show her? What? If you went straight back to bed and had a good night's sleep. How so? Well, you would be making the decision. Stephen, the man who chose not to lock the front door. Okay, listen, if I go back to bed, 
I need your word that you'll all clear out once you're done. It'll be like we were never here. And be careful with these bloody candles. They're a fire hazard. Nice, 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 nice,